match. The recent results between the two ladies and gentlemen. The last one was Ted Cup 20. The happy was successful with the 2 and 0. Oh, but the one before in TP League December. That was the one that everybody talked about. Happy was dominating. Three, almost four TP League qualifiers up until the very last match. She was ultimately close to winning four monthly qualifiers without dropping a single series. But in the grand final, there was 1-2-0 and he took it home and he stole the perfect qualifier year off of Happy. But in general, Happy should still be considered the favorite as he's just more active, uh, practicing more, more invested into the game. But 1-2-0 can create some magic when it comes to Undead Mirror. He already eliminated Lin. Can he go one step further and take it all home? Wait! Got 1-2-0 and the yellow color on the upper left-hand side of Tight Hunters, which is our proving ground. And Happy trying to defend his title from Ted Cup 20. Back to back on the bottom right-hand side in the blue. So usually, Happy plays Lich Ghouls and 1-2-0 plays Ted Feeds. Is that still the case? Or was there a change of mind in the past couple of weeks? It's a DK, we're waiting for 215 gold. Then there's a graveyard and it's Ted Feeds confirmed. And on Happy's side, he's in love with the Lich. He's in love with the Lich. And he plays Lich Ghouls. They play this for years against each other now. And both have been very, very successful with it. So you can't blame them. Both also for years incredibly stubborn. <laughs> To not switch it up. Not even for a map. Acolyte says hello. So this play by one to zero now. I could probably cast this blind. This play by 1 to 0 now seems illogical. In theory, you can't last it against the Lich, but he's baiting a Nova already. And he's taking the easy level 2 away by cleaning up the turtle spot with only skeletons. It's not investing too much. The dynamic here is. Players forces are under attack. Ghouls are extremely good early game. And 1 to zero's plan is to slow Happy down. At some point, the Destroyer push is getting absurdly strong versus Ghouls and wipes them all out. And that's the power spike that, wants to z that 1 to zero wants to hit. It's been that way forever. We've seen some adjustments with the Dark Ranger second. I wonder if that's still on the table. And here we go. Very, very, very important. Ghoul split onto the DK down to 50%. Here's the Nova, there's the kill. And 1 to 0. Oftentimes takes a map to get into a series. Coil. Ooh, doesn't stick. DK is dead. That's bad. You want to slow down the Lich, not fuel him. Something went. Horribly wrong. With that DK positioning. Ooh, arms in the air already. That was some... Like... Even if he coils the skeleton, what does it really accomplish? I feel like the mistake was done earlier when the DK was way too close to Happy's ghouls. Jay Persky, thank you for the sub. Way too close to Happy's ghouls. Catching the Nova, getting more hits. 
And now Happy's level 3. Like, this game is completely in Happy's corner. Very, very, very early on. A player's forces are under attack. Dagger sold for boots and this is gonna be incredibly oppressive. Deny too late. Cannibalize this early on tight hunters. I know that Happy likes to play Cannibalize from time to time on Turtle Rock for red spot into ghoul healing. It is a fantastic upgrade though. 50 gold, quick research time, and munchy munchy. Plus, claw, gloves, mental, big mana, potion, and boots. <laughs> you see this inventory, and you just want to tap out. Oh my god. 1 to 0 has the tech advantage, always, in their matches. But what do destroyers do? If you're facing a level 4 lead. Nova on cooldown for 4. No counter. There's no TP. Happy respecting this. Well played by 1 to 0. So far. But happy coil. Oh! No coil. Of course, Nova I meant. Okay. 1 to 0's inventory might not be the greatest. And the start to the game wasn't the greatest. But Fiend's way better late game army. And Destroyer's hard counter Happy's entire army. So risky, man. <gasps> Ruined Bracers. Nice. Very nice. The player's forces are under attack. Can 1 to 0 still hit the destroyer timing? Cues it now. Ziggurat finishes off to the middle. Needs more gold for the Dark Ranger though. Wait, no Dark Ranger. He's engaging with this. Oh, cr what? Crypt Lord? Why? Is he trolling? Did I miss something? Crypto was sick in the game versus Labby. But... It's no silence. It's a non-dispellable disable, okay. But... It's so mana heavy and they can't attack destroyers. Crypt Lord. Okay, apparently I missed this match versus Labby. Okay.
sold the rune braces, by the way. And... Also shade? This is odd. One to zero, grasping at straws. Happy knocking on his door. He wanted that big consumable. It's another heal potion. Narrow tower up front. Might not be healed. Impale is sweet. Nova follow up. So far he can hold this, but now one to zero supply block. The first big real fight of this grand final. Silence. Okay, but the potion was there. Second impale doing good. But the heal scroll is already there too. Now it's all about the ghouls. The positioning seems nice for now. Little surface area on these fiends. First one falling finally, but happy down to 35. Now it's about the heroes. The lich is a weapon of mass destruction, of course. That's a destroyer falling. What the hell is happening? All ghouls gone. Happy is down to the heroes. What? What? A player's forces are under attack. No way. We have an impale very, very, very soon. Can you get a kill with that? Unlikely. What the hell? Big mana potion on the DK though. That is a lot of coils. A lot about sustain now as well. Lich! Holy! He stuns the DK! Kills the Lich! What? Happy not playing around the Impale well enough! I cannot believe my eyes. That this Crypt Lord is working so well. A player's forces are under attack. I just can't! What the hell? Invo potion on 120 as well on a map that only has one shop. Lich back from the tavern. Mana is an issue for sure, but Nova is there. Ooh, coils on both sides. That you need to work overtime. Happy's DK in trouble. It's DK on both sides in trouble. Coil up. 1 to 0 with the potion. And the Lich is dead again. Oh my god. 1 to 0 stomps Happy into the ground. And I cannot believe what I just saw. One two zero lost his hero in the early game. And Happy's Lich was looked outstanding. What? These impales were pretty damn good. But <laughs> that's, it's not supposed to be this way. Sick. Okay. Maybe we have to rethink Undead Mirror. That fight into 1 to zero's base was terrible by Happy. And it's similar-ish to another 1 to zero approach that we've seen before. He played Naga for a while for that extra burst damage. And so he's now doubling down on that AoE burst damage, um, not with Fort Lightning, which always needs a little bit of time, but rather Impale, 
for that stun. And here it worked. Impale Nova combo in 120's base. And Happy lost absolutely everything. One oh one two zero. Wait, that's the wrong game. <coughs> We're not playing Titanus again. Am I dumb? Oh well yeah, the answer is clearly yes. My mind cannot comprehend that this just happened. But okay. If that's the future of Undead Mirror, I'm all here for it. And then we'll happy do adjustments. <laughs> It's a long series. You can react to your opponent. Crazy. Crazy. Springtime is happy's loser's map. I doubt anyone will claim the unoccupied expo in the middle. That's a bit uh, too gimmicky. We stick to our guns. As always, happy Lich Ghouls, 120 Ted Fiends. Speaking of Ted, the show match is coming up right after. The winner of the grand final faces the Orga. I hope someday people make a map where both sides have an unguarded expansion. I'm sure it leads to new builds. I thought the same about some sort of mercenary camps. So this Crypt Lord play, sorry, I have to get back into this. In a... You gotta rely on... The fact that you dispel the Dark Ranger's silence pretty much instantly, right? And that you have extraordinary mana management. That's some... Um, that's some confidence. Yo, Yannick, what's up? Yo, okay, I'm... I'm still baffled! But let's see if this works again or if this was just a fluke. And how would this game go if 120 is not losing the DK early? Good block with the skelly. Bit out of position, 1 to 0. But this forward narrow helps quite a bit at first, but then it exposes the back. Happy realizing this rather quickly. The tech is already running. So if 1 to 0 loses Acolytes now, this is a disaster. Oh, sick save. Lich in trouble on the other side. Only level 1. Minimal number of Nova. And 1 to 0. Not only is he defending this well, he's also putting pressure on ghouls that fiends can now farm. <gasps> Was it an acolyte? Oh, did one die? Yep. Yep. Okay, now it's starting to get troublesome. Tech halfway. Oh boy, Nova hits hard. Ghouls, Ravage, oh that's two. It's expensive for Happy, but it's way more expensive for 1 to 0.
Ooh, another one! And also, of course, Lumber Economy. He can't play his fast tech. You can catch up to a degree if you sell the town portal. I, I move that echo. I can coil, I guess. That was a lot of damage. One to zero is supply blocked. Has lower income, has low lumber, and his strategy revolves around fast tech. That's sick. <laughs> he did sell the TP, alright, that is necessary. But now what? Wow, what a sick counter by Happy! Circlet gloves, boots, that's sweet. This takes forever. Yeah, good point. Ziggurat is also late. A player's forces are under attack. We wait for the acolytes to re-establish this and then we compare the gold. Cause Happy didn't even need a TP. Naga, yo, desperation move. One to zero knows he got, he's got to get something done. Naga can still scale. Decently well into the late game if you protect her, but one to zero is creeping as greedy as possible. Okay. Eight hundred gold difference. <laughs> Thank you for the gifted sub new hero to one of the most wonderful persons that we got here. To Stefan. That's awesome. Sobi mask. Okay. Lich had little progress. But finds level 3 regardless. Plus the replenishment potion. 1 to 0's creeping is sick. But it's still an 800 gold difference. One to zero is struggling so hard for Lumber that he needs another Necropolis. Yo, this game! Emperor's Revenge. Emperor's Revenge. Boom! That's another one. Tech cancelled. Huge lead in all regards for Happy. My god. That Crypt Lord somehow made him mad. He poked the bear. He took that Crypt Lord personally. What a slaughter. Mm. Oh, that narrow tower is saving li lives. Is it lives if it's... No? I don't know. Um, I'm having a hard time seeing 1 to 0 coming back from this. But that was the case on map one as well. Auto zero can only now attack again. He has tier three to catch up. <laughs> Happy's timing attacks were gorgeous. Auto zero tried to the best of his abilities to save echoes, but against. This many ghouls. It was quite an investment, man. If this doesn't work, it's a huge lead, but yeah, perfect timing, good execution. Not flawless, but good. A player's forces are under attack. And Happy has the world of springtime in the palm of his hands. Flute and Subi Mask items are certainly helping 1 to 0 here. But let's be honest, he needs a miracle. Statues late, tech late, no Dark Ranger, no Crypt Lord. Valenzi 28, thank you for the 21 month sub. And no shop means no orb. Destruction. <laughs> 
Yo, Happy is living in his very, very own world, this map. This time, no third hero, no destroyers. A little bit of hero focus, but Fork Lightning level 1. Just tickles. If you don't have Nova, you're just not competitive. The tower helps, but only so much. Quite fascinating how the supply is similar-ish. But it's only ghouls going down. They can be replaced. Yeah, this was very clear to everyone with a somewhat educated eye that this game derailed during the tech to tier 2. The 10 minute tech is just simply too late against it. Can't afford that. Naga falls. And that's game. Happy ties up the series. The best of seven is now a best of five. But also, as always, the pick and ban process. This was Happy's most favorite map that he can play in the entire series. His first loser's choice. And with that, there must be a reason for that. His strat just worked beautifully. The timings hit perfectly. And that's a tied up series. Thank you, Z Carter 3535 for the sub. Now things are, are getting interesting. Is it just happy fumbling game one? Or was map two the outlier? Is happy picking up momentum now? Or is 1 to 0 just simply striking back and we trade maps back and forth? We'll see in a bit. $1,400 on the line for this one series. Colors are changing. 1 to 0 now in the blue, happy in the yellow. And map 3 done. 1 to 0 upper right hand side. And happy bottom left. Twisted Meadows is the map, everybody. The greatest map of all time that should never be replaced anywhere. It should be in all map pools across the globe, in all timelines. Casino Warcraft is what they call it. Because there's so many items and you can end up with spell shields, scepter of silences. Or just complete trash. You gotta be a little bit lucky. So. No changes whatsoever. One to zero knows. You gotta be ready for this ghoul timing. There's no doubt about it. You gotta be ready. It will hit you, one way or another. But are you in position? Are you ready? Are your acolytes safe? Cool to see, again, new variations of this encounter with the Crypt Lord. With new ghoul push timings, timing pushes, ghoul push, ti ghoul time. You know what I mean. Best non mainstream caster of the year, by the way, here. Right, right, right here. Even the Acolytes get saved, but again, the Nova advantage, you're trying to bait Nova 
Oh, deny. Ooh, a little late. They're trying to bait Nova as fast as possible and then somehow play around the cooldown and get the bigger creeps or damage on some ghouls. I gotta say, this worked well. Mana regen is working. Lich is down to like 60%. Um, I don't hate this early game. Solid control, of course. Lich always with the advantage of being a range attack hero. Only a ring, though. And this cost a lot of time. And there were so many saves that it didn't give happy level 2. Can't be surrounded now though, instant counter block. Yeah, these guys know exactly what they're doing. Operating on a very high level. Fiend coming in. It's the first little experience for 120, but can't prevent level two. Not with vision through the forest. It's chip damage. Oh, careful. Can't overextend with that fiend. It's so fragile. Tech timing by 120 again. Extraordinary. A player's force I like this early game for the Necromancer. I like it a lot. <laughs> Cannibalize again. Happy with the new appreciation for the ghoul upgrade. Game going pretty much according to one to zero's plans, no? Except that there's a level three now. Ghoul. Oh, denied with a dagger. Sweet. Panorama! One, two, three. Thank you for the sub. Ooh, if. There's no way you can steal this. Nope. Lich gets it, Lionhorn, extraordinary as well. Happy usually behind in upgrades because he just can't afford it. Time, no resources. And this ha will help in every single fight. Trying to get vision. 1-2-0 with all the sneaky plays you can think of. But not against Happy. Here we go again. Nova. Start a step in. Oh. That's a dead DK. And that's problematic. Because the Lich is occupying the altar. So he has to TP with no HP left on the bar. Ooh, this mid game. This mid game is not good at all. 1 to 0. Wake up. That was too greedy. Mm, almost lucky. That he got out there, but no. Woo. Okay, that's a roadblock. A little fumbly bumbly, as a Canadian cast would say. No levels on 1 to 0. This swung back. Very fast. One Nova on the DK with the follow up is all it takes sometimes. I want to zero still comfortable. Apparently. Confident, apparently. But for how long? Destroyer form into. Ooh. That ziggurat. Is it late? Did he forget the fourth ziggurat? 
Because I don't see a Crypt Lord. A player's force is under attack. Wow, mental strength by Happy once again, one of his biggest assets. Decides to not contest anymore. Is it too late for the Crypt Lord now? Yo, Fruit of Accuracy is nice. Gotta make the decision now. Dark Ranger for quick access? Or Crypt Lord because it worked so well on game one and against Labyrinth, apparently. A player's forces are under attack. Run for the tavern. Who gets served first? This has to be a tavern hero. Dark Ranger by Happy. Nothing there, smelling blood in the water, but too little, too late. Crypt Lord at the 8 minute 50 mark. TP's gone. Happy's going for the red spot, of course, because he feels dominant. His third hero is here. His levels are there. He got a big mana potion again. But no red spot just yet. They will meet here. No TP on either side. Orbs already up. Rune Graces. Earlier it was sold. Ha! <laughs> My mind was very confused when I saw the silence on Happy's Hero. But that's because the troll is gone and he found the Staff of Silence. This is best of both worlds now. Oh my god. Wait, where is it? Did he just sell it? Okay, dude. If you think so, I don't know, man! Waiting for the Impale, there's no Dispel against the Silence despite the Destroyer being up. No Impale just yet, full mana. One to zero's Fiend struggling, his entire army is struggling. This fight position is not nearly as good as the one before. Still full mana, Crypt Lord. Where are the Impales? What's he waiting for? Lich under attack, needs an invul, got it up. Silence again, waiting for the level 2 coil. Lich in trouble, gets it and he's safe. Now retreating, but there's also no narrow. Happy's Lich is eating 1 to 0 alive for now. But for how much longer? Can he survive a little bit? Here's the impale, but didn't do much. Was he thinking could maybe catch the DK? That didn't work. Coil hits. He's safe. There's another impale. No way. Dark Ranger dead. Counter focus. 1 to 0. Okay, okay, we're live. And that Dark Ranger kill was not necessary. Gambled a little bit, maybe. There was also the big mana potion gone. Goggles now. We have web up. TP, red spot. Oh, feet for free. He needs that red spot now. What he got? Orb of Darkness, pick it up. Oh no, the creeps block it. Ay, ay, ay. He wanted that red spot item under all circumstances. Still more to creep. High velocity now. The Crypt Lord has 15 armor. Boots of Kalthalas. Not impactful at all. Went of mana stealing can become a factor later. What we got now? Soapy man. 
Okay. Heavy air by happy. Doubling down on the crypt. <gasps> Island. A player's forces are under attack. Ooh. Will happy realize this? We don't have an acolyte here, right? At least not yet. Ooh, but happy is getting in a position to fight. To push. What we got? Potion of restoration! Yo! Acolyte here now. One to zero, not in position. One guard gets caught, but the fiend is dead immediately. Town portal home now. First acolyte down. Second one about to fall. Where the impales needed. First one only on the ledge that didn't hit much. Of course, the army is all air. Destroyer's doing a good job dispelling. Fiend saved to the side, but can't be saved. The next one falling. No narrow tower here. No mining for one to zero. And this lich is also under trouble. The potion of restoration is still there. A little bit of healing here. Statue come in. Lich in trouble! But the impale a little bit too early. Coin was up. That was a very, very, very strong fight for Happy in the uh, main base of one to zero. Mining re-established, and now we got a new win condition. That expansion. Happy, knowing happy, probably saw the potion of restoration. And he can scout quickly. He also saw the zeppelin. There is uh, a few good indicators now that Happy has an idea, but can he stop it? A player's forces are under attack. Unusual to see one to zero without upgrades. Extraordinary inventory. Happy is still scouting other expos. But what is one to zero's idea against this mass air? I don't know, fam. Nova hits hard. Frost armor diminishes the damage. Impale covers the retreat. The silence just a hair too late. Now we got a lot of destroyers. Happy on a warpath. 60 food. Glitch in trouble. Lich is diving deep here. Where's the impale? Is it ready? Oh no, no mana. Used it before. Lich might get a Nova out. No, statue saved as well. But one to zero, my friend, you need production. You need units. Two Crypt Fiends. Lots of destroyers. As long as they have mana, they are great. Static defense. We got a tower up. They're very good against destroyers. DK in trouble. Needs a potion. ASAP. Lich also. Next on the menu. Potion of restoration, but it's just melting. Happy throwing the kitchen sink at the hero. The darks are falling slowly but steady. There's only one potion left. Almost in the air, but too late. Lich dead. Orb gone. And of course, no Nova anymore. 10 supply lead is still there. Double spirit tower. 1 to 0. Holding on to dear life. Every destroyer falling is 5 food. With the towers, this might work. But then what? Then expo. But happy is counter expanding. Only the heroes for now. And 
no nuke, dude. This hurts so much. 80 second bench. Game over. One to zero taps out. It was a little bit too much. Despite the island. Despite the potion. That lich kill was not meant to be. A split second. Decides about life and death. And this time in Happy's favor. Back to back wins. Halfway done. Two Ted Cups in a row. Even for Happy, that's not too common. And I understand you get a lot of gold from a Staff of Silence. But it's a Staff of Silence. Should you? The DK loss earlier also. Yante, thank you for the two month resub. Support much, much, much appreciated so we can still broadcast the best Walker 3 esports in the world. Paying the bills, keeping afloat. And we have oh, an unupdated score on the board. 120's map pick goes to Happy. That is not a good sign. Happy on the right hand side, 120 on the bottom left hand side. We have Concealed Hill. I got a feeling. That 1 to 0 needs a win now, otherwise, Happy is running away with that series. We see the same base build with the forward Ziggurat. And we see the same Lich School build. Tomas Onyo, thank you for the one year resub, dude. That is fantastic, thank you. Silence feeds Destros, not good. Does it if it's coming from the staff? Because you don't invest mana. Does anybody know? Maxwell 2013 2 thank you for the sub Get him in boys by the way if you have an Amazon Prime sub open we gladly take it Did Destros devour buffs and debuffs no matter where they stem from yeah, but do they just dispel them or do they also get the mana is the question <gasps> Ooh, Ogre Lord woken up. A player's forces are under attack. Can he throw a shockwave? Will he throw a shockwave? Not really. Things kind of weird with the end snare. This is uh, the ghoul push slowed down severely. And with that, Happy abandons the idea of diving into bases again. Another end snare. Chance for a ghoul kill? I don't know. They do get the mana. Sick. Did not know this. Apfelsinbaum with a gifted sap. Let's go! Love the support, guys. Love to see more than 2,500 people watching as well. Happy's tech pretty much on par. But 1 to 0. 
still with the lead and a safe base. This is not nearly as bad as the catastrophe we witnessed on springtime. And with that, Happy crossed the entire map twice, back and forth, without creeping, without too much experience. And 1 to 0 also switching it up a bit by not instantly harassing but rather creeping himself trying to steal that shop away happy still busy here for a bit ring of region quite nice all the chip damage is gonna be negated oh, oh, oh. That's a big steal. Level 2. Having the Unholy Aura is quite outstanding. Fiend's just way too slow. And he's getting distracted here. I... Also denied. Nice. 1 to 0, still clearly playing his best. Not slouching, A not slacking. Are under this is. Like, in comparison to the three maps before, a way better developed uh, DK than what we've seen before. Claws also nice. Kanzai Kaiser, thank you very much for the, what is it, 32 months. Hey, beautiful. Are you talking to a mirror, Kaiser? Thank you. Arigato. Feels like Happy attack. can't really play his Lich Advantage this time too much in comparison. But things can swing around w within the blink of an eye. You can feel it. 1 to 0 plays a little more careful after what he accomplished early game. He got level 2 coil already. But giving up a red spot for free? Probably not allowed. DK is not out yet, so this would be solo experience if Happy is not killing it quick. And here's the DK. That's a bit of trouble. Nova immediately. DK also very hurt already. Shockwave hits. Coil is there. Uh-oh. This is weird. He's just begging for a Nova. On the arm again up in the air. Just again a second too late. Oh, happy Snowball advantage, man. It's getting strong now. This coil is here. Jesus, just thank you for the prime sub. That's exactly what we need. Nova there. Coil used as well. Doesn't have to fear hero focus now. Frostborn hungers. Ooh, that was close. No second Nova. Oh, no follow up Nova. One to zero. Facing the abyss. Has movement speed advantage. Can't allow the Lich to get blocked so much. Happy in position. Now messing up a little bit. And that's big damage done. Big damage done. Ring of regen also. Absolutely fantastic. Oh, Nova! Coil! What? Oh my god! Why didn't he just coil? Is he mad? Oh, wants to save the mana for later. Jesus Christ. A player's forces are under attack. Oh! Okay, here we go. He called the fiend, was on cooldown? When I looked, it wasn't. Are you sure?
You're seeing things again. Yo, that was a sick save, though. Dark Ranger by Happy, big mana potion for 1 to 0. For the first time this series, Dark Ranger. Interesting. Despite this low level lich, 1 to 0 still feels the advantage. Is Creepjack okay? Silence on one side, Black Arrow on the other, lich in trouble. Waiting for the destroyer upgrade. Nine seconds. This is a bit too early. This is seven seconds too early. Fiend's down. Ghoul's a little bit distracted, but so are the fiends. Gotta run constantly. Where's the damage? Onto the Dark Ranger for now. More creeps are getting involved. And snare make things weird. Destro's up now. Happy no web, of course, but focus on the heroes. Nova Steel, nicely done. DK also caught Dark Ranger in trouble, but healed up. Now the Destro. No mana at the moment. DK in trouble. Lich far forward, getting addressed immediately. Oh, Happy playing this well. Down in supply, of course, but this will change in a bit. Destroy upgrade ready for him in five. And ready. A player's forces are under attack. That was the big mana gone. Consumable advantage will be on happy side. What he got? Went of mana steel. Okay. Heal scroll instead of the big mana. Weird position with the creeps involved for the third time in a row. DK in the back line. It's all about XP. No levels nearby. 1 to 0 has no silence, mind you. One to zero completely abandoned the idea of going upgrade advantage, right? Like in the past, in December, town is under siege. it was all about upgrades. One to zero struggles to get the level three edge though. That's the opening happy needs. All this bad. All this real bad. Nova counter on ghouls. It's time to wipe them out now. This coil hits. Lich still there. Waiting for the next Nova, but it hits hard. Fiends disappearing. Of course, way more expensive than ghouls are. He can eventually clean the ground, but happy already. Free shots on the statue. So impactful. DK on happy side. Needs to get it, but no more crowd control. No more Nova trying to turn around. Coil is not ready. Invol 1 to 0. Takes it last second. But can't follow up. The unholy aura is the same. Now what? Heal scroll is remaining. Oh, destroyer! DK! What? Who dies first? Is it a double kill? No! Info potion on happy side. Is it three in a row? He makes it three in a row. Oh, necromancer struggling. They were dancing around each other for minutes, from creep camp to creep camp. And then the one opening, the one opening, Coil misses Fiend, gone, GG. Oh, 1 to 0 traded his mana potion for a healed scroll invo potion, but was that really the right call? Three in a row. Match points happy. Also, three in a row. Cleanser21x, thank you for the sub. Extraordinary level of play. Every mistake is game.
I think he thought the fiend was already dead, but then one tick from statue came in, so fiend was safe, and then he coiled. Ah, rough, 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 rough situation for one to zero. But he has turned series around against Happy before. This is not unprecedented. We've been there. Tommy Lee John, thank you for the tier one sub, my dude. Smooth JK, also thank you for the sub seven months. Who's Happy's opponent? self banned Apparently that's not the case anymore. He's just completely ignoring chat and is not reacting with bans anymore, is what I heard. Match points. Ted's already shaking his boots for the grand final, for the, for the show match after. Yeah, it's been... It's been a pattern. 1-2-0 selling items for more units, more upgrades, or other items, like Invo Potion Heal Scroll. Pretty much the entire series also in the past this happened. So, one, two, zero, bottom right hand side. We are on Turtle Rock, on the same lane on Turtle Rock. This could be the very last match of Ted Cup 21. I don't think I have to explain the early games anymore. Lich Ghouls, DK Ted Fiends. 1 to 0. Utterly destroyed. Happy previously on this map. He needs things to go right again. Coils have to hit. A player's forces are under attack. <laughs> Creeps back in position. And again, the instant harassed by 1 to 0 is gone. Our player's forces are under attack. Both have shown time and time and time again that their strategies work. It's all about execution. That's really what it is. I wouldn't mind seeing Happy's cannibalized creep here again. It's very predictable at this point. Ooh, can't happen. to zeros in position but a town is looks like he's wasting a lot of time for the circlet is he not reading this correctly that is odd movement I gotta say Stealing the circlet, stealing this item. We all know that Happy loves to pimp his lich, especially early on, where it makes the biggest difference. And red spot gone. Unpunished. Is that the right call? 
A player's forces are under attack. Onto Zero might know a thing or two more about Warcraft than I do. But this is level three. Unpunished. Rune Bracers. Unpunished. Acolyte coming in. I really hope it's not one of the mining ones. Should be the scout echo, right? Yo, it is. Not much momentum. Ooh, invite for happy. Playing around the end snare, well done. Forces are under attack. That's so much Nova. In the TP League December Grand Final, Happy was standing here for like two minutes. Invisible. Waiting for his opponent to arrive, but he was never there. This time it works out. This could have been way worse. Way worse. And again, Happy's just standing there. What the hell? A player's force is under attack. As if there's some invisible trap that we don't see. Okay, got it eventually. For ring. But yeah, I I I don't understand Warcraft on Happy's level to make a call if that's good or not. I'd say no, but who am I? Puts of Katalas on the other side. Probably won't help him too much. Level 2 on the Lich. That will. 1 to 0 with the second hero advantage. Struggling to find level 3 though. These games have all been decided around the 10 minute mark. DK very tanky. I like that. So, 1 to 0 arrives at tier 3. Well, the last fight was a couple of seconds too early. Now you gotta find your opponent to hit when destroyer upgrade is ready. Ooh, the slaughterhouse is occupied by a statue though. Not perfect. As Happy gets the Katka's pipe! Oh, that's huge. That's huge. Dipset, thank you for the 18 month. Very good items. But Scroll of the Beast, double level 3, Crypt Lord Cued, Destroyer Form halfway done. All the consumables for one to zero. All of them though? Happy's coming in. Destroyer timing more than 10 seconds. Second heal potion. That was the item combo that helped him on map one to win the game. The only map so far. Destroyer up. Not using the timing without the Crypt Lord, though. Dark Ranger by Happy, some things never change. Frenzy ready. Ghoul's healthy. The next fight could decide the Grand Final. This is pretty perfect for 1-0, to zero, I'd say. Heroes are here. Destro's up. Web as well. A 
player's forces are under attack. And so many consumables. Chip damage on both sides. Mana's looking good for both. What he got? Went of mana stealing. Pretty good! Especially on a Crypt Lord who suffers from low intelligence. Like most of you too. A player's forces are under attack. Ooh, happy shocking around. I can't find him though. Nice dodge. Nice dodge. Second red spot, 1 to 0 now. War some battle drums, just a little bit of damage. Not too impactful. What Neo saying, you two, the Irish band is dumb. Flo Duke, sometimes I really love you. Yeah. <laughs> Maziondo as well. Heal scroll. Oh, so many consumables on one to zero. He gotta. He got. He's gotta win this fight with these consumables. This is the moment. Happy wants to end it. Happy wants to claim his back-to-back -back championship right here. And 1 to 0 isn't ready yet. Nova hits hard. How many exit kills? Nice and pale! Fiend still goes down. And the statue too. That's not good. Six food down, 400 gold, and the TP 700. And the skull of the beast too. Or was he using that before? Yeah, I probably sold it. A player's forces are under attack. <sighs> Happy's getting further and further ahead. But he's paying upkeep. 1 to 0 is not. Four, four, close to three. Happy also flirting with level four, but the other heroes, not that, oh, okay, Dark Ranger is closer actually. Map almost empty. How do you salvage this one to zero? Maybe with upgrades. Two one attack upgrade. That's his former strength. Shade, perfect information. 1300 gold. But at some point you gotta start production. Will Happy be forced into yet another fight in 1-2-0's base? Okay, here we go. With the help of the tower, Fiends, no damage up time just yet. Nerub gone, 1-2-0. Kinda supply stuck at 60 now. That might be a problem down the road. With shop access, Fiend annihilated. Garks are up. But they all web the destroyers. The Garks can't really attack anything. DK diving deep behind enemy lines. Crypt Lord still an impale left. The fiends are all disappearing. One to zero. Need to produce more. Need these Garks up to do full damage. 
questionable here, but Happy is also losing a ton. Still fiends up. One to zero. Did a magnificent job saving most of them while the Gargs were eventually ravaging the destroyers in the air. What now? Supply narrowing down. Two fiends caught with the Nova. Ghouls helping out, opening up the way. Still shop access. We have another impale soon. Uh-oh, Lich, trouble. That Brilliant Zora helping out a little bit for the Mana region, but happy. 20 food down. He started this being 10 food up. And now the coils are hitting once again. Focus fire on the Lich. Nice silence. Fiend falls eventually. Level 4 on Happy's DK. Not the most meaningful level. 20 food, though. And that destroyer is falling for yet another 5. Nice nuke on the... Oh, the Dark Ranger! Focus fire! Coil too late this time on Happy's side. And this was without the Scroll of Healing, without the two heal potions, without the second shot of the Rod of uh, Mana Stealing. 1 to 0, lures Happy into his home, puts him in the oven. And we have ourselves a momentum shift, everybody. The map was empty. Happy felt like he has to do something. And in his base, he's almost untouchable. Dude, that fiend control was out of this world, though. He saved so many of them. And impales, man. I think my impales are pretty great, but have you seen these? Turtle Rock is 1 to 0 country. But from here on out, all maps remaining will be happy maps. Dude. This Crypt Lord build. It's actually working. It's really good. He makes it work. He still has to win two more maps back to back. On happy maps. Just making sure. Yo, happy in the yellow, one to zero in the blue. Seventy-one. Thank you for the four-month resub. Any primers in the house? We gladly take your primes, everybody. We're on Northern Isles, former home of the undead, with the same builds for the sixth time in a row. But I, I truly don't mind. these games are just phenomenal. Whenever these guys meet, it's just phenomenal. Luckily, 1 to 0 has the same race as Happy for the Happy Maps. You do realize they have a bit of a different playstyle. Like, different hero, different units. <laughs> okay. I just can't get enough. Yup. Happy again across the map. And one to zero. He caught him. But this will still end up in his base. Nerub Tower, 30%. Ghouls block the entrance. At least one. Yeah, but that's attack delayed. Ooh, this is already pretty good for Happy. First Acolyte down needs to be rebuilt pretty much immediately. Ghouls connect at what cost? Can he surround this Lich? Skeleton! 
three points around at the altar. And Happy always sells TPs. Caught him. But is it enough? He's still slowed. Frostborn hungers. Gets it. Plus XP. Oh boy. At what cost though? How many acolytes still alive? Three? Four? Three? Ooh, this is still weird. This is still weird. Nope. Push abandoned. This is okay. Lich benched for 30 seconds. On top of potentially ghoul kills. Town is under a player's forces are under Ooh. Tech is delayed though. Tech is delayed. No deny. Yay, yay, yay. So this is odd now. Because Happy took the fast tech away from 1 to 0. 1 to 0 took a high level Lich away from Happy. Both got robbed of their favorite tools. Ring of Regen, DK2. That's around next to the altar, dude. Just gorgeous. Trying to cancel some healing with an illusion I like. Well done. Okay, dust settles a little bit. Happy creeping with ghouls, only green spots. 1 to 0 shocking around. Stole two spots from his opponent. And 1 to 0 again. Little starved for Lumba. Should reposition this ghoul. Good vision though. Player's forces are under attack. Happy with the way faster tier 3. Oh my god, he queued it immediately. Over DK, over Slaughterhouse, over everything. 1 to 0 will be struggling with the timings. A player's forces are under attack. What was the item? Sold it already, huh? <laughs> no level 3 DK. This is not great for 1 to 0. Despite the Lich kill, this game is certainly in Happy's favor. He can turn around. He got two more Nova. Had to decide what to coil. He coiled one. Okay, but this is half a disaster for 1 to 0. Waiting for the lit for the return damage. Fiends had to run the entire time. This is such an unusual timing. But so well done. Players forces are under attack. Ooh, this didn't hit either. 1 to 0 needs to kill some ghouls, but how? There's barely anything left. Happy can eat skeletons. And hit you one more time. Every mistake might be lights out for 1 to 0. A player's forces are under attack. Ooh, 
again. Happy with the kill. Diminishing ghoul numbers, though. So how good is that late game? Dark Ranger out, 1 to 0, Ooh, he was like 15, 20 seconds behind. It feels playable, but it's tough. We still have rat spots. We still have one two zeros consumable on the right hand side. <sighs> Happy's faster than everything. Zero going to the red spot later. Was some battle drums again. One of the weaker ones. Crypt Lord bringing the orb because that tier 3 was so late. He had no time to go back to the base. I'd say level like level 3 on the second hero is much more impactful than level 4 on the first hero. So in that regard, 1 to 0 is doing a better job. Double claw on the ledge. This is winnable. Four one two zero. Uh, oh, I say that, and he struggled with the creeps. <laughs> Good of cunning, more damage. Happy with invul potions and heal scrolls though. A player's forces are under attack. Happy 432.6. to zero needs this camp. Gets level three, gets level two, gets caught! Up in the air, that's a lift, can't TP out, Lich gets caught, almost surrounded, Impel is sweet, coil, 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 who swaps the TP, wants to get out of there, Crypto though, the armor is not enough, with the big mana, the orb, and the hood of cunning, the value now, that's in the altar, it's in the thousands. Oh, whoa, 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 what a sick surgical strike, one to zero. Facing the silver metal. Happy one hand of the trophy. No chance for a tavern revive, really. He's not in position with nothing. And now you gotta hold this without a shop, without your third hero, without the potion you just found, without the minus armor. This is unwinnable. Happy's timing with the wand of the wind made everything so weird. 30 seconds still on the clock. Can you hold? Can you survive? Maybe the home turf advantage. It would be extraordinary. Garks again coming in. Destro saved. 10 seconds on the clock. Silence again. The silences are top. Okay, Crippy back, Coil hits, Impale hits only the Lich, you gotta pass over that orb, finally, finally! But that's all the mana. Ooh, one to zero is alive. Barely breathing, but he's alive, Impale! No way! Happy! You should have seen this coming!
And now we're talking. And now we're talking. Happy still has two invults. Dark Ranger back. Would love to see the replenishment potion used. Big mana on the crypt, but of course less than ideal. All heroes are on important levels. Whoa, what to do to fuel this situation? Going into upgrades. Late game 1 to 0 is oftentimes better than late game happy. Ooh, but the lack of a shop is hurting now. This lich is a monster, by the way. Just as a heads up, there's an ad coming in four minutes and I exhausted my uh, snooze button. A player's forces are under attack. What's happy doing? <laughs> we get a shade mirror. Third attack upgrade over the defense upgrade. Thank you for the warning. We are appreciating you appreciating that because I got Reddit hate comments about it. <laughs> There's just nothing I can do at this point. One to zero, nine hundred gold. A player's forces are Happy is an upkeep the entire time. One to zero saw this. Ooh, that DK got an invul potion, but can he get home? Lich trying to close the door, gets up front, needs to dance around it. With the slow, it's a bit better. But the healing is missing. Nova, invo potion necessary. Would have loved to hold on to that. Not a great start for 1 2 0. Needs a potion ASAP, but Shop is on the other side. Blocked by himself. Lynch kills him. And happy again with the hero advantage. Lynch next on the menu. So many hero kills this game. Potion last second. The invo potion made him vulnerable. How ironic. Lich is a monster, but the Crypt Lord has to hold the fort by himself now. He can't even attack air. Lich trying to save himself, but that's impossible. Just as impossible to win a fight with one versus three heroes. Your Ted Cup 21 champion is the Emperor back to back. Ah, oh, so sad. Oh, so sad. Getting the invul potion from this position is hard. And he felt like he had to get it. And now, of course, it looks stupid. But if you give Happy all the invo potions, he's going to win the fights as well. So... He was stuck between a rock and a hard place. <laughs>